Hey everyone, it's Elliot Chun here from the BestBuy.ca plugin blog. I've got in my hands a Netgear Arlo wireless camera and I am going to set this up and show you how easy it is to set up thanks to technology. First things first, you do want to make sure you've got the app installed on your device here. I've got it here going on my iPad. It's available for Android devices as well. So once you've got the app installed, you are good to go. And then the second thing you want to do is actually get the base station. And that's what we saw earlier in the unboxing video. Here it is right here. What I did is just to save some time and just show you, you do want to get your ethernet cord plugged in first, have it going to the router, which is back here. And then you've got the power going in. And I've just had it running for about a minute now and you can see that the lights are ready to go. It's ready to go for the Netgear Arlo. Next up too, you wanna make sure you open up Arlo and put in the four lithium 3V, three volt or one, two, three batteries is the model number here. And if you're wondering what this round device behind here, it's actually the mounting bracket. You can see that it's uh, magnetized to the Netgear Arlo and that's what makes this so unique. You can actually peel it off, put it on, and this mounting bracket is so easy to install and has it going in any which direction to make sure you capture the content you need to capture. So let me show you how easy it is to pop this open and put the battery in. If you look closely here, you can see it's on a lock position. There's the unlock, so I'm gonna move that over to the right push down, pop it up, and I'm just going to put the batteries in and show you how easy it is to now set up. I've got my Arlo now loaded up with the batteries. It did actually turn on blue for a second just to tell me that I've actually put the batteries in the right way. And now it's time to sync the Arlo camera to its base station, which is just behind it here. You can see there are some icons here that tell you the power's on and the internet is connected. This here is, is the sync button and it's telling you that it is trying to sync. To show you where that button is, is right here. You just need to hold it down for a second or two. And as you let it go, that flashing green light is going to happen for you as well. Now there's also a sync button on the top of the camera right here. And I'm going to also hold that down. And if I'm within one feet to three feet, that blue light is actually going to stop flashing when it has actively connected with the base station there. So. We're going to wait for that to happen. We've got everything set up now successfully with the sync, with Arlo and the base station, and of course the app. So now let's take a live look at what's happening here with the device. And with the iPad here, you can see that swirling circle in the middle there. There we go live. There was, is what's recording on good old Arlo. If you don't believe me, here you can get an extra little tour. Of what's going inside my place right now so there we have it successful sync hopefully those easy steps help you out to get your arlo added what's really cool is this app lets you to add more devices such as the arlo q and uh, we'll take a quick look at that in my next video as well so make sure you tune into that but the um, netgear arlo i'm excited to try this out both indoors and outdoors because there's 100 percent wireless as you can see here and it's also uh, waterproof, weatherproof, so I should make sure I check things in outside. So there you have it. I'm Elliot for the Best Buy.ca plugin blog. Check out more Arlo on my YouTube channel. Thanks.